you may have renamed your levels for many times in Revit software or even rena renaming your views from the project browser window I mean the views that are related to the levels I mean when we want to rename them then confirm level name here we can rename the view whether clicking on yes or no it doesn't make difference if we click on no it will be applied only on the particular view but if we click on yes it will be applied on the entire project and the related views however some of you the users check do not show me this message again and then they click on yes like this way then let me for instance rename this and as you can see we can easily uh, rename them without clicking on yes or no by default since the confirmation is not uh, shown anymore but how do we can show the confirmed level rename again in Revit software I mean here we do not have a tool in Revit software to show that message or confirm rename level anymore but we have to use Revit INI. So we close Revit and then we open Drive C, local disk, then in user folder. Uh, then I click uh, on this these device's name, then app data, roaming, autodesk. Then uh, I click on Revit, I open it afterwards the desired versions of Revit. Watch this, Revit I and I. After opening this notepad file, then I press down Control F to search for, for instance, mess. Watch this, message. When we check do not show me again, we'll have 0 or 07, 06 and some other values. So in order to show the, that mass message again, we change these two and then we set 0 and then we save it to make that enable then I relaunch Revit wait for a second then I open another project I click on level to rename it watch this would you like to rename corresponding view and then we can choose yes or no for applying the changes so guys if you just clicked on do not show me this message again and you wanted to return it back you have you have to change the rivet ini notepad to fix this issue